Doctor. Excuse me. Oh, Powder Gangers. Why? Get out of here. You frickin' jerks. Hey, what's going on YouTube? Today we're doing some more Fallout New Vegas. Uh, I'm not going to keep you here too long, but don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for some notifications. Let's get into it. Last time we, we just pretty much finished up the tutorial. So, let's, uh, let's actually get into this a little bit. Let's see where we're going. Done being nice. Oh, okay. You don't hand Ringo over soon. I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? Hold on. We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. Uh, what the hell is your problem? You are currently my problem. Or future problem. Uh, Trudy, you're not who I need to talk to. Where's my... Where's that lady at? The lady with the dog. Um. Well, that's the bathroom. That's that's not her. Wait. I thought she was in here. Am I mistaken? Oh, th there she is. Howdy. She didn't spawn. <laughs> Come on, game. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Come on, game. Um. I'm a little short on caps. I don't suppose there's any work available. Oh, we could do some work for some money. What do you do around here? Let's talk about the area around Good Springs. Um, let's talk about the area. What do you want to know? What towns are nearby? Southeast of here is Prim. Can't miss it, since it has the giant old roller coaster right in the middle of town. Okay, sweet. That's where we need to go. If you follow the road north, you'll eventually hit Sloan and Quarry Junction. They mine rocks or something, but I heard they got troubles lately. I wouldn't head that direction if I were you, though. They okay. Got up there that don't take kindly to getting shot. Well, I don't think anything takes kindly to getting shot, but that's that's fine. NCR. That was the guy that was in here, wasn't it? The New California Republic. Bunch of settlers and soldiers coming in from the west, fixing on making Nevada their own. They can be right pushy, but the roads are safer because of them, so I tend to let it go. Not that I hmm. have What does the NCR keep you safe from? Well, the wildlife for one thing. Rowdy locals for another. They're protecting their own. Just happens to help us. They've been holding off this other group from the east, too. Oh, right. The, uh, whatchamacallit people. Um, what do you know about the other group? Got a funny name. Call themselves Caesar's Legion. Caesar's Never Legion. in these parts, so I couldn't tell you much. I hear rumors, that's about it. Supposedly, they keep slaves and they got some real nasty ways of killing folks. Hmm. But maybe that's just something folks in the NCR cooked up to make themselves seem more useful here. Less uninvited. Well, that's good information. What kind of creatures are out there? Yeah, what, what things don't like getting shot? Hmm? Around here, mostly coyotes and geckos. The coyotes are pretty dangerous in large packs, but otherwise they're nothing to really worry about. The geckos aren't too tough, but they've got a nasty bite. I've heard about bigger, nastier versions out in the wasteland, but I've never seen them. Stick to the roads when you can, and steer clear of the hills north of Good Springs. The critters up there are big and poisonous. Okay. That's all I wanted to know. Let's talk about something else. Okay. Else, just ask. I think we're going to go to Prim, but maybe we'll do it. Eh, yeah, let's go to Prim. That's where we need to go. We don't need caps. We'll get caps. Take the road southeast out of town till it hits the freeway. Prim is a town with a roller coaster straight south. Can't miss it. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear, but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily. You never know who you'll run into. Off the road, okay. you'll start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. Good to know. Good to know. Alrighty. I hunt geckos mostly. The meat's pretty good, and I can always find a buyer for the hides. I also help keep the town clear of rad scorpions and coyotes. Not many people live in Good Springs, so wildlife is always creeping in. Seems like it. Yeah, we had some problems. Oops. Um, that's all. Until next time. 
Oh, what a good doggy. What a good doggy. Um, let's move. Uh, so we need to go. Let's see. Data. Go meet Trudy at the Prospector Saloon. Okay, so we can do that. She's just in there. Um, otherwise, we do the reunion, I think, is the other one. Go down to Prim. Oh, no, maybe it's they went that away. That's the one. Inquire about delivery assignment. Yep, talk to Victor and Goodsprings about your rescue. Find the man who tried to kill you. That's the main one. Let's do the campfire one. Oh, man, I'm so used to escape being the way to get out. What is happening? Oh, I had the command button up. Whoops. Easy Pete. All right, let's talk to the lady in the saloon. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. Is this more of the tutorial? Show me what you have for sale. I heard an argument. What was that all about? Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Yikes. Where's Ringo now? He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Ghost Town gunfight. Okay. Why not just kill Cobb and be done with it? That's pretty aggressive. You mean murder him? That's not our way. Even if Cobb is scum, he can bluster and threaten all he wants. What are you going to do? Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Powder gangers? Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. Yeah, probably not. Long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's Who thought that was a good now. idea? Never mind, I want to talk about something. Okay. All right. So we got that info. What happens if I help Ringo? Who was the man you were arguing with? Oh man, she knows lots of things. I guess she is a bartender, huh? If you were able to get Ringo out of this mess, you'd have a decent reputation around Good Springs. I'd even set you up with a Ooh, discount. Okay, we can help out Ringo. Ringo would also make the powder gangers mad. And they've got a lot of friends out there. Well, I don't really care about the powder gangers. We'll deal with them. That's fine. Maybe we need to be their friends, though. I don't know. I haven't decided what we're doing. So I help Ringo, and Good Springs will be... Will like me more. What if I help the powder gangers? Don't know why you'd want to do a thing like that. Yep, you'd get on their good side, but people around here wouldn't appreciate it one bit. Okay. So we can either side with the crazies, or side with the town. <laughs> Good to know. Good to know. Who's the man you were arguing with? He's a convict, just without the chains. He said his name was Cobb. Powder gangers is what they call themselves. Plenty more like him out there. Alrighty. That guy was part of the powder gangers? Okay. I'm trying to track down the people who attacked me, know anything about them. Do you know the robot who rescued me? Oh, we're supposed to talk to the robot. Not much, other than there are a bunch of freeloaders who expected a few rounds on the house. I was able to get them to pay up, though. Of course, one of the great cons did knock my radio to the floor by accident, and it hasn't been working since. Wait, but I can hear the radio right now. Um, I don't care about your radio. Where did those guys go? That seems kind of rude, but you know, we did get almost murdered. We'll be nice. They were having some kind of argument about it, but the guy in the checkered coat kept shushing them. It sounded like they came in from the north through Quarry Junction. If that's the case, I can't say I blame them for not wanting to go back. Why is that? That whole area is overrun with the kind of critters that just get mad if you shoot them. 
Merchants avoid that whole stretch of I-15 like it's radioactive, which it could be for all I know. So where are they headed? I didn't hear exactly, but the leader was talking about the strip. Fellow wants to get there and avoid the 15, he'd have to go east. Take Highway 93 up. Okay. We're getting a lot of info. Do you know the robot that rescued me? I know that thing as much as anyone else around here. It mostly keeps to itself, which is just fine by me. You don't like him? Why is everyone so sus of this robot? It acts friendly enough, but I don't trust that whole cheerful cowboy act. I find it all very creepy. Fair. You know, that's fair. Uh, what does he actually do around here? Other than rolling around once in a while, it doesn't do anything useful as far as I can tell. I don't know why it took an interest in you, but I'd be careful. It's never helped anyone before. Well, maybe it wants to be my friend. Maybe it, have you ever tried to be its friend? Just because it's a robot? Freaking rude. How long have you been, or how long has he been in Good Springs? It was here when I took over the saloon seven years ago. Some people have said its owner lived here, but no one knows who it was. Okay. Fine by me. Um, I don't think I can fix tech or anything. I think that's good. Yeah? What about this? Can we get rid of some junk? She has... Ooh, we could get rid of some stuff. So, I don't want to put on all this broken stuff. Like, we have this machete. We're just going to get rid of this stuff. Otherwise, we're going to be broken, and I don't want that. They started us with a bunch of broken stuff. Um... Laser pistol. Like all this stuff. Lightweight leather. Metal armor. Just get rid of it. I should just drop it because, you know. But we can just chuck it because we're, we're not going to get all those caps. I mean, she don't she don't have it. So we're, we're trying to start at a normal sturdy caravan shotgun. Holy crap. Okay. I think that's good. We can just get rid of that stuff. Does she have anything we can take, though? That's good. Dirty water. Uh, ooh. So you read those and they give you a buff from it? Uh, I don't think we really need much, though. I mean, maybe a Nuka Cola would be good to have. Or some more dirty water, but. But we'll we'll make it work. Here you go. Have my stuff. We uh we don't want to be that that guy that has has all that extra gear. We're starting we're starting from scratch like a normal person. Give me one of these motorbikes. Um, let's go talk to the robot if we can find him. He's wheeling around here somewhere. Alright. Scoot, scoot. Come on, where you at? You up here by this, the gas station? Looks kind of creepy up here. Is that a cigarette box? Sarsaparilla? Oh, baby. Oh man, I'm gonna have to get used to the buttons. They're so different than, than Skyrim. It's the last thing I played from Bethesda. That's Whoa, crazy. hold on. Who are you? And what are you what is going doing? on? I'm not an enemy if that's what you're asking. I'm just having a look around. If you're gonna shoot, you better not miss. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard. Oh, it's that's Ringo. All. We got off to a bad start. What say we start over with a friend? Oh, well, this was not what I wanted to do. Caravan. 
Do you know there's a name man named Joe Cobb looking for you? Let's uh let's jump from the caravan game. Yeah. He doesn't look very tough though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I can handle all of them in a gunfight. What are you going to do about the powder gangers? Are the powder gangers out to get you? We're just going to go down the list. I'm going to lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Okay. Maybe I can help. You know, we could help. We could help each other. We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board... Well, you don't trust me, man? I'll ask around so you, you don't think I can handle myself in a fight? I was thinking of myself, actually. Who's gonna watch my back while I'm watching yours? If you Start insist. Sunny smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Okay, so we can wrangle up some some help. Um, wait, can I have this stuff? Hold on. Turpentine. Oh, baby. Okay, we got some loot. Is there anything good? Whiskey. You know we need that. That's good stuff. Ooh, bottle caps. Okay, E is exit. We'll get used to that. One. We'll get used to it. Oh, can we take this guy's stuff? It didn't say steal, so I'm I'm assuming this is all for us. Lad's life. Is that a safe? Whoa, okay, we're getting we're getting the loot. We're finding the loot. Bottle cap, egg timer, lead pipe. Oh, we leveled? Hey yo. Let's go. Okay. Um I think it's important to put guns up higher. Um And I don't really care about sneaking that much, but I've never been a sneaky person. Um lockpick is good to have up. Um speech is good to have up. Oh, we have 11 skills to put in. Holy moly. Let's get all these to 40. And then... Increases hit points. Hmm. Maybe we will level sneak up a bit. Also, repair would be pretty good, and so would medicine. Yeah, this is really good. Cool. Cool. Uh, ooh, we get a perk. Um, confirm bachelor. In combat, you do 10% against male opponents. Outside of combat, you'll sometimes have access to unique dialogue options. Okay. With the intense training perk, you can put a single point into any of your special attributes. Lady killer, you're better against women. Rapid reload makes all of your weapons. Oh, that's a good one. Rapid reload makes all your weapon reloads faster by 25%. Yeah, that's pretty good. With retention perk, the bonuses granted from skill magazines last three times as long. And then Swift Learner. With each rank in Swift Learner perk, you gain 10% additional XP. Wow. You just get a ton of XP doing that. I feel like Rapid Reload is going to be good. Pretty helpful. Pretty freaking helpful. What's in this sack? Some noodles? Uh, no, we're good. Oh, purified water, though. Yeah, we'll take that. Okay. So Ringo wants us to wrangle up some people. He wants us to Ringo wrangle. Um, we still want him to talk to Mr. Robot. Wherever the heck he went. Um, I don't think he's over here by the school. I think he's back this way. I 
I, I believe I saw him back towards where we, we started by the dock. I think that's back this way. Mr. Robot. Oh, Mr. Robot. Are you around? Hmm. It's weird that there's not a run button. Like, that's just walk. Leveling up our sneak probably would be a, a smart idea. It's too damn good in these games. But if we just get our pistols up and stuff, we should be okay. That's not creepy. Um, where the heck is this robot? Did I hear him? Back this way? Oh, -ho, I found him. He's next to the shack. The Shake Shack. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, buddy. I would like to talk to you, Mr. Victor. Hey, partner. Might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Uh, are you decent in a fight? I could use more firepower. Um, let's talk to him about the other stuff first, and then we'll talk to him about that. Thanks for digging me out of that grave. Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. Uh, how'd you find me? I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. So okay. It looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Bad eggs. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. Do you know who of those men attacked me? Um. I can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out. Okay, well, we already figured that out. Um. How'd you end up in Good Springs? I moseyed into town, oh, 10, 15 years ago. Before that, I, um, I can't quite seem to recall. Okay. Odd. Anyway, it's a right peaceful town, and I reckon... He, he seems like a pretty good robot. I don't know why they're so questioning of him. You know what I mean? He's just a nice guy. He's just helping out. I've never seen a robot like you. I'm a Securitron. Robco Security Model 2060B. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. Alrighty. Will do. Now, are you any decent in a fight? Trouble with rustlers, huh? Oh! Alright. Those varmints will be running home with their tails between their legs soon enough. Yo, we got Victor. Alright. Happy trails! Let's go. Vi oh, Victor Shack. You got a nice little house here, man? Dude. I'm happy for him. What what a nice quaint life that he has out here in the um shambles of a town that is left. But he's making it the best. He's making it the best he's got. Where to next? Um Cause let's see quests. Ghost Town Gunfight. Talk to Sunny Smiles. Okay, that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Talking to Sunny. Hey. All right. What do you want, Easy Pete? Howdy. What do you know about Joe Cobb? Oh, well, if Easy Pete says that he's bad, he's bad. That's helpful. Welcome. Yep. Thanks, Easy Pete. That was that was wonderful. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? 
Well, uh, I'm gonna help Ringo take on the Powder Gangers. I might need your help. Say no more. I'm in. All right, we were, that was easy. Just like that. Just like that. I have a feeling that I'm going to end up fighting those guys one way or another. So I might as well get it over with. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. Yeah, of course they will. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. Hey. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. Well, we have the robot, robot too. Dynamite somewhere. And Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. Okay. Any idea how to convince Trudy to join us? A silver tongue would help. Convincing Trudy that we Oof. had a good plan to win the fight would also help. I have one of those. So, we're good. I don't I don't need any more information. I, geckos, mostly. I, I don't I need any more information. Scorpions and coyotes. I, I don't. Goodbye. I'll be waiting. Goodbye. What in Sam hell are you doing? How much have you had to drink, sir? Howdy. Oh, well, I guess I've had the same amount. Where is she? I guess it's nighttime, huh? Maybe we should, um... Maybe we should take a nap. Whoa, did that go instant? No. Okay. Seven hours. W. I thought it was just like... Uh, 5, 19 a.m. Um, she's not back yet. Okay, more waiting. Not seven hours. How do I move this up just like... Oh, the scrolly button. Okay. Different than Skyrim as well. That's fine. We're getting used to it. Oh, hello. Hi, Trudy. I got things to talk to you about. So you're on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. It's she already risk, knew. But I suppose you have to do what you think is right. Um, oh, see this? This is why we level the, the speech. Right here. This is it. You should help me take down the power gang. Bullets, explosions, lots of fun. Lots of fun. I was planning on sitting this one out. But for some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. Look at that. Let me have a word with a few other folks. And That's why we love the speech. Some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone Charisma. Gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Okay. Does Good Springs get many visitors? No, no, no. Anything interesting? Nope. We're good. Trudy. Out there. You're on the team. Put you to good work. Uh, general store? Aha! Actually, we need to talk to Easy Pete. Sir, where'd you go? You're always sitting out here, having a drink. Yeah, you are. Howdy. Give me that dynamite, my good friend. Too dangerous. Gonna kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. Oh, give me the stuff. I can blow it up. Um, oh man, I can't blow things up. Oh, okay, well, that is what it is. We can't have the dynamite. Um, oh, we got to talk to Doc Mitchell, right? We got to talk to the Doc, and we got to talk to the general store. Okay. Hey, bud. Why do you, you have scrap and more scrap and a gun and some old cigarettes and papers horn bubblegum yo you got some good stuff here man you know I would probably never shop here a milk bottle this is kind of a rundown store my guy you must be the one Doc Mitchell you need to buy some stuff the way I heard it I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office I've got plenty of supplies for sale even got some weapon mods and special ammo. Oh, if you ask me, if you do you right, now? Perhaps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Okay, 
can do. He's got bullets. We need, um... We need 10 millimeter rounds and 9 millimeter rounds, right? Pistol scope. Okay, that's kind of nice. Let's pick up these rounds. Oh man, he's got a bunch of 9 millimeter rounds. I really want that. Um, does he have any 10 millimeter rounds? Probably not. Ooh, leather armor. We're going to pick that up too. Silence pistol. Oh, stim packs. Actually, we're going to go get some stim packs from what's his name. So we should be okay. Um, thanks. I need supplies to fight the powder gangers. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. Well, if we get rid of them, then you'll never have to deal with them ever again. And I don't have barter, so I'm going to stop talking and I'm going to turn around and walk out the door. Right. Just keep me out of it. Is there anything else? I guess we're just dealing with this uh, on our own. Oh, oh uh, we have um weapon. Boom, we can put this bad boy back on. Yeah, we should pick up that freaking whatchamacallit. Oh, I like it. Okay. Uh, we gotta go to Doc. Which I have no idea where Doc is. Honestly. I do not remember. Is it this building right here? Is this where the dock is? It's either this one or the one over there. It's the buildings that don't look like they're absolutely destroyed. Oh, it was this one. Hey, bud, you got some stim packs we can borrow? Hello. Hey, buddy. Welcome back. I had hoped you wouldn't need to Look at that mustache. So soon. What can I do for you? Quality mustache. I'm hurt, Doc. I need help. The town's going to be attacked by bandits. Anything you need to help? Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Well, it is a wasteland. Good in a fight with my bum leg, and my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. Good man. Good man. Don't look like nothing to. Oh. Am I actually not hurt? Okay. Well, never mind. Um, you take care now. Sweet. We got some stim packs. Um, is there anything else that we need to do? Ghost Town Gunfight. Fire Easy Pete's Dynamite. We can't do that. And we can't get chat stuff. So I think that's everything we can get. Let's go back to Ringo. I feel like I'm overthinking this, and it's not going to be that difficult. Like, it's one of the first things you do, yeah? Maybe, maybe I'm overthinking a little bit. Hey, Ringo. So what's going on? Did Sonny agree to help We got us? some people. We got some not people. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. Let's do this. Time to look alive. The powder gangers are here to play. Well, that was quick. Where's Trudy and the rest? They're getting set up in cover, but it might not go well unless we get out there soon. Alrighty. How many are there? At least six. Joe Cobb included. That's ah. What do you mean? Six. That's it? I'll be set up near the store. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Okay. Um, let's quick save just to be sure. And let's go blast some fools. If we had that dynamite, it would have been way easier. Oh, get your guns. Get your guns. Get ready. Let's blast them. Oh, they're coming in. Howdy. They're coming in hot. Ow. Why am I getting hit behind cover?
You know, where there's the aid. We'll drink some dirty water, eat some gecko meat. We're healing up. Nice, took one down. Let's get in there. I'm not scared. I'm not scared of Joe Cobb. Get out of here, Joe. Dirty Joe. Vilified. Your overwhelming, overwhelmingly monstrous behavior. You have become... What do you mean? Oh, with the powder. Okay. With the powder gangers. I was like, I just, I just did a good thing. All right. The good guys like me. Yo, give me your magnum, my guy. Nice. Dynamite. And a shotgun? And we can have a baseball cap? I owe you a huge favor for this. Here. Yo, we got some bottle caps. Crimson Caravan funds, but I know they'll understand what Crimson Caravan. I'm Crimson. Hold on. I'm Crimson. You're welcome. Didn't I hear you say something earlier about not being able to pay me now? I did have what was left of the Crimson Caravan money, but I wasn't sure if it was my right to just give it away. Well, I mean, I saved you. I owe you more than that, though, so look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp up in New Vegas if you ever visit. Okay. Will do. Wait, I, was, I wasn't I was done looting. Yo, a baseball bat? Honestly, I kind of want to just take a bunch of this stuff because we can sell it. Yeah, make some money. Give me that. Was that everyone? One, two, three. Oh, nope. Here's another one. This guy looks kind of like a... Oh, cowboy hat. Yeah. All right. All right. We got a cowboy hat. Putting that bad boy on. Let's, let's suit up. You know what's funny? I bought that leather armor and I never put it on. Uh, Desperado... Heck yeah. I don't really want to wear this stuff because it's, um... Didn't I buy leather armor? It's the Powder Gang stuff. This is... You know what I mean? Uh, do we need to repair our weapon? Oh yeah, it's pretty beat up. We have, we have some shotgun going on though. I like that. And we have the weather pistol. Okay. Sweet. Yo, that wasn't too bad. The, um, the only thing that I need, oh, it's V. Okay. That whole fight, I was like, how do I use, um, uh, that V obviously makes sense, right? Should have thought about it. Okay, we did our duty. Sweet. What's on the What's on the agenda? We can go sell stuff quick. Um, and then they went that way. Inquire about the delivery assessment with the administrator of the Mojave Express in Prim. So we need to go to Prim. No matter what, we need to go to Prim. Is is what I'm gathering. Um. So let's do some selling quick. Let's go to the, the general store and chuck all this junk we got, and then we'll uh, we'll head to Prim. That was a hell of a fight. Can do. I don't need this baseball. I don't need this baseball bat. Binoculars. We'll keep that stuff. Ammo is always handy to have on us. We'll get rid of all this junk. Q. 
cue ball. Dirty water's good. Restore all body parts. Holy crap. Okay, doctor's bags are good to have. Dynamite. Yeah, I think we're just going to get rid of the dynamite. Uh, egg timer we don't need. Well, those are for fixing stuff, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Knife we don't need. We'll keep the lead pipe as a good melee weapon if we run out of ammo. Um, we can cook stuff with that, but it's fine. Mercenary grenade rifle. <laughs> oh my god. I don't think... Uh, I don't think I'm supposed to have that. <laughs> I think that's from the... Uh, whatchamacallit. So we're going to get rid of that too. Powder gang outfit. Oh no, my baseball cap. Oh wait, we have the... Uh, never mind. I was going to say, we, we don't want to get rid of that. But we have the other thing. Scotch. We don't need that. Don't need two shotguns. I don't think we need a shotgun at all because we have this sturdy caravan one. Stealth boys are good. Sarsaparilla is fine. Throwing spear we're going to get rid of. Tribal raiding armor we're getting rid of. Varmint rifles. Oh no, what is that? Bills. I think we're good. Um, did I not pick up that uh, leather armor? I must not have. And then, can we get the uh, laser pistol focus optics? Um... What? Laser pistol combat sights? Yo. Oh, those are for laser pistols. Duh. I'm not using a laser pistol. I'm not using a laser pistol. Where'd it go? Excuse me? Uh, oh, items. Weapons. Peril. Um, is it in the aid? It is not. Is there a mods one? Misc? Ammo? Items? Excuse me. Okay, well, I guess we have that thing now. We could buy some stim packs, but I think we're okay. Man, I'd really like to find just that regular pistol mod that we saw. There was a sick one I thought in here. Maybe that was the other lady? Huh. Oh, here we go. Laser pistol combat sights. Pick up some more Magnum rounds? Absolutely. Um, oh, pistol scope. Nice. Nice. And then... we grab these other pistol ammo? Cool. Alrighty. Sounds good to me. Another satisfied customer. Goodbye. Take it easy now. now, how do we go about modding? Do we go in here? Items, pistol, mod, pistol scope. Yo, okay. We're learning, we're learning. Nice, now I can zoom in. It's a little zoom, not crazy, but I like it. Um... Is there a place to heal anywhere? Or should we just pick up some food quick? I'm glad that business is over. I like it when Good Springs is nice and quiet. Show me what you have for sale. 
She's got lots of stuff. Dirty water. Probably going to be good to have. Let's grab some food quick. A couple Nuka Colas. That should be good. Just to tie us over for now. Be careful out there. Trudy got blasted. Holy crap. She almost died. She almost died. Um, aid. Drink a little bit of, a little bit of that. And, um, do we, we don't have things that can remove rads yet, huh? That's okay, though. Let's take a look at where we need to go. Where's our map? Rim is south. Okay. Good spring source. Canyon wreckage, though. I don't want to go check that out, but let's go to Prim. Alrighty. We're done here. We could, I guess we could talk to Doc to heal up, but... Yeah. We're fine. We take the highway. Heading to Prim. Man, so far this game's been pretty good. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. It's been it's been fun. Uh, I'm gonna have to get used to using Vats more because I think it's probably pretty important. Uh, it's a little different than Skyrim, of course, but um, the Vats is huge. But also, just like getting our weapon upgrade and stuff is gonna be important. I think. I think that's I think that's really important in this. It was pretty important in Fallout Four. So, uh, I would guess it's pretty similar feeling. That's my, that's my thoughts. I'm, I'm really wondering how good this, the story gets though. Once we get into like New Vegas and, and all that good stuff, I feel like it's going to get good. Oh, Las Vegas to the left. Okay. So if we're going to New Vegas, it's probably that way. Prim is this way. What's this little shack, though? This is this is the problem with these games and me, and me. I uh and everyone that plays these games. I know what the problem. I walk around. I see something. I go to it. I get distracted for like two hours, and I never finish the thing I started doing. So <laughs> if we get sidetracked a lot, I'm sorry. But I am almost 100% sure I have ADHD. I am not diagnosed. But I have some telltale signs. Not, of course, self-diagnosing. That's, that's no good. That just makes you worry about stuff. Average. Oh, no, my lockpick's not high enough. Ham radio. That didn't do a damn thing. That didn't do a damn... Excuse me? Oh, Jesus. What is happening? Sir? Excuse me? Oh, powder gangers. Blam. Get out of here. You frickin' jerks. Oh, man. Well. You know. That's how it goes sometimes. Yikes. Holy moly. That guy got blasted. There's an airplane just hanging out here? Can we fly in this? Hmm. Is that a toilet? That's a hand sink. 
Yo, I'll take ammo just hanging out. That was one of my favorite perks from Fallout was the one that gives you like a ton of extra ammo everywhere you look. <laughs> so you're never running out of ammo. It was so good. Oh, is that another powder ganger? They're all over the place, huh? Oh, no. Landmines. Dude, get out of here. Police baton. Stimpak, though. Okay, that's pretty good. Dynamite. You know, dynamite... Oh. Because I stole? I stole from bad people. It's fine. It's a wasteland. It's fine. How much karma can you actually lose when you're stealing from bad people? Okay. Cool. Let's head to Prim. Man, like I said, they are everywhere. I wonder if there's, uh... Creepy monsters down there. I'm gonna guess probably. Looks like a bunch of radioactive waste. Okay, focus. We're going to Prim. We are going... Oh, that is radiation. Okay. That's tasty. Where are our rads on our thing? Does our health just not go all the way up when it's when it's raid radiated? Um. <laughs> Hi, little guy. What are you doing? <laughs> Yo, you're still alive. Thing is a tank. Holy moly. Is that a cockroach? Sir? No? That is a fat cockroach. Yikes. Oh, there's another gecko running around. Oh, he mad. He is super mad. Blam! Uh, no. Dude, they have a lot of health. For a little guy? For just a little guy? They got some health on them. Holy moly. Alright. That is some beef to them. Is this Prim? Did we make it? I think so. It's they said it was the one with the big roller coaster. Um Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. Prim is off limits? What's going on in Prim? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. Well that's There's not good. <laughs> two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. <laughs> Okay, shouldn't you be protecting the town or something? Yeah, let's be a jerk. We'd love to, but they don't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they did, we're in no shape to protect them. Okay. Why can't you protect them? We don't have the equipment to take out the convicts. And even if we did, we need some extra hands for backup. I have hands. You should talk to Lieutenant Two of them. Bruce. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you get shot. Lieutenant Hayes, okay. Um, well, that might be a good spot to stop for the day. We did a good amount. We got, we got into Prim. It'll be exciting when we get, get to go for it a bit further. So sweet. Let's save. Alrighty. Like I said, that was a pretty good spot to stop. We're going to do Prim next time and, uh, see how that goes. Seems like we got a lot, a lot of, uh, fighting to do that was that was good though we had a lot of fun uh finished up the uh, good spring stuff so 
We'll see what we get into next time. Thanks for hanging out. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you had a good time and enjoyed what you're watching. And uh, I'll see you next week.